Hey guys, okay, so this is my first outfit for my boots and jeans video. Starting at the bottom, the boots are from a local boutique. I think I got them for about $19.99. They're kind of a dark chocolate brown, which I really love these. I was on the lookout for these forever this year. Um, they have kind of a nice stacked heel with a kind of a different angle on it, which was kind of caught my eye when I did see them. Um, the jeans are from Target. Uh, they're the Massimo brand. They're about like $19.99. The top is actually from Forever 21. I got this here recently. It was about $22 to $25, somewhere in that range. A little bit more expensive than the average Forever 21 top, but you can see why. I mean, it's just, it's gorgeous. It's got these gorgeous bat wing sleeves. It's got embroidery in the front, and it's a very, like, sheer kind of gauzy material so it just kind of moves with you when you walk um this is like my favorite top right now every time i wear it i get compliments from complete strangers every time so for this outfit just keeping the accessories simple i just have on one of my grandmother's old watches all right guys next outfit the boots are from rue 21 here recently they were on clearance for like dirt cheap. I think I spent like $10 on them or something if I remember right. They're kind of a tan color. They're a little bit higher than most of my other boots as well. Makes it easier to tuck in the jeans. The jeans are from Paxson probably like two or three years ago. They're that Bullhead brand which is like 25 bucks or something. The top is from a Forever 21, it's one of those uh, domain kind of sleeves that are bat wing effect going in there. Um, I like it, it's really stretchy material, so it's very comfortable. Um, the necklace is from Forever 21. It's one of those lariat style necklaces. It has like the black beads and then these little tassels at the bottom. Uh, to complete the outfit, I just threw on some gold bangles and a couple of like wooden bead bracelets from like Anchor Blue and Claire's, random, and a Forever 21 ring for like four bucks or something. This outfit, the boots are from Target. Again, I think I've had these ones for about two or three years. The black ones that kind of have like a little buckle here and they kind of have a wedge heel. Uh, they are a work horse in my wardrobe. I swear I wear them with jeans, I wear them with dresses, I wear them a lot at work. I just, they are one of my favorite pairs of boots and I reach for them constantly in the winter. Um, for the rest of the outfit, the jeans are from Target. They're kind of like a gray wash, skinny jeans. Probably about like $19.99 or $24.99, somewhere right in the lines of that. I never really go over that budget for jeans because I just don't wear jeans a lot. You know, I only wear them in the winter. And plus where, you know, where I work, you really can't wear jeans. So I can wear them on the weekend. That's it. So I tend to not spend so much money on them. Um, the rest of the outfit, the top is kind of like a gray, uh, just basic t-shirt. It's kind of a slouchy t-shirt. I could wear it off on one shoulder if I wanted to. It does have a little bit of a pocket detail. I think I got this at Old Navy for about like five bucks or something. And I have a couple of them actually. You have a brown one, a black one, and like a purple one I think. So yeah, that's, that's that. And for the rest of the outfit, I just added my furry vest, fake furry vest, that I got at a local boutique here for about like, $19.99 so I added that on there and then I do have a necklace from Anchor Blue that has a bunch of little chain details and like beading and little charms on there too. Um, the necklace was like $9.99 plus I did buy one get one half off for their jewelry. Okay, next outfit this is a little bit more casual than what I've been showing so far but I thought I'd put this in there because it is another pair of boots that I have. Uh, the boots are actually like fake Uggs. They were from Walmart from like two or three years ago and they've actually held up. They were like $19.99. So jeans are from Paxson again, $25. The top is actually from 
Anchor Blue. It is one of the last purchases that I made from them. Uh, it has a little bit of, it's just a basic white top. It has a little bit of white lace on the bottom. It's really long, which I like because I kind of have a longer torso. The sweater is actually from PacSun. Again, I think I've had this for about a year or two. It's from that brand Kira. I think it was about $25 or $30. It is like kind of like a hoodie. And it's that bright turquoise, which I love this color. And it's actually um, insulated, you know, it has like the fake fur on the inside, so it's actually really warm. I'm sweating right now as I'm recording this. Accessories, I just added on my dangly earrings from um, Hot Topic. They have like a little bird and little pyramids on there. Okay guys, for this outfit, my boots are actually from Target. They were bought this year, so you might be able to still find them. I know they had them in tan, and then they had the black ones too. They have a zipper all the way along the back and a couple of buckles, a little bit higher than the average boot, which is awesome. They were about 25 bucks. Uh, the jeans are from PacSun. They're just a plain black pair of jeans. I think this is the only pair of black jeans that I own because I don't like how they fade after you wash them a couple of times. Uh, the shirt is actually from Anchor Blue here recently. I don't know if you guys know, Anchor Blue is actually going out of business. Um, I found out the hard way. I had a gift card for uh, Christmas and I happened to walk in the store and there was like posters everywhere saying store going out of business. I went online and you can't even order anything online so I have this $50 gift card that I had to spend. So I just like randomly grabbed whatever you know, I could get just to spend the card and not lose it. I did pick up this shirt. Um, it's got flower pattern all over it, yellow, red, and blue with a black background, as you can see. I think it was like $5 or something after there was like a discounted percentage taken off too, so super cheap. Um, it does have a really cool like lace pattern here on the sleeve. So that's a little different. I like that. So I grabbed it. Uh, as far as accessories for this outfit, kept it pretty simple. Uh, just my Target watch for like $14.99. Uh, a pair of earrings that I actually got at Anchor Blue in like kind of like a package, you know. I think it's in one of my haul videos. Maybe I'll put the link to it right here. And uh, they're just like little tiny silver bones. They're kind of cool. And then I added my lion ring to top it off. Next outfit, these boots are actually from Payless. I've had them in my wardrobe for about five years, I swear. They're stacked wedge heel. They have like a brown suede and then a fur lining on the inside of the top of the boot. But you could actually roll down and have like two different looks with one boot. Uh, the jeans are from Target at uh, Massimo again, 1999. The sweater is actually from Old Navy. It's one of those heavy cable knit sweaters. It's in a dark chocolate brown. I actually got it at the end of the winter season, so it was on clearance. I think I got it for about $9.99. So if you're really if you really like these long sweaters like that, definitely scope out old navy at the end of the season when they do their end of the season sales. You can get these sweaters for like dirt cheap. The um, scarf is from Old Navy too. No, take it back. No, yeah, it is from Old Navy. I'm sorry, my memory is fading. It was like 10 bucks, I think, 9.99. Um, for the rest of the outfit, the white tank top is from like Charlotte Ruse. It was like four bucks or something. And I just added my little bird necklace from uh, Hot Topic, which was like 10 bucks, but again, buy one, get one. I had these ones in my wardrobe for about five years as well. They're kind of a brown, a black suede, and the little bow detail and kind of a cuff at the top. Uh, I think I got them for about like $25, something like that. And I did buy, I liked them so much that I went back and I bought a pair of like chocolate brown ones too. They're like the same exact thing. So yeah, I've had those. Had them in my wardrobe for quite some time. They're still going strong. Jeans are from PacSun. I actually ruined these by getting like some 409 with bleach on on them and it kind of like turned them like bright and yellow here and there so I did a video on 
how to distress them and make them look like I meant to do that. So if you want to see that video, I'll go ahead and put the link down below or right here so you can click on it and go check it out. Um, the rest of the outfit, this top is from Paxton as well. I think it was $19.99, but it was buy one, get one half off. So one top was $20, the other one was $10. And I got two different tops. This top is actually by the brand Roxio. And uh, it does have these really cute, like, fluttery sleeves. That's what caught my attention. You know, I was like, I really like that. It's super cute. Well, as soon as I got it home and I put it in the wash, uh, it shrank on me. This is actually the end of the shirt. I have to wear a black tank top under it to make it long enough to where I feel comfortable in it. So be warned about this shirt if you come across it. For the rest of the outfit, I just added a necklace that I got at Wet Seal. Here recently, it was in their clearance stuff, you know, the whole like, buy one item, get the second item for like a penny, one cent. So I got this and a couple of other things. I think it probably came out to like $2 for this necklace. It's kind of a brass metal with like flower details. Um, it has like little pearls inside a couple of the flowers. It's really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed it. And then I just topped this outfit with like a headband that I got from like the dollar store. All right guys, next outfit. This is um, my boots that are from Target. I know you guys have seen these before. About $24.99. I've had them for a couple of years. I've say two or three years. They're kind of a whiskey brown and they have a couple of buckles. Uh, jeans are from Paxson. No, no, no. I'm sorry. Anchor Blue. They were about $19.99, something like that. Two or three years old again. They're a dark, skinny jean. Nothing special. Those are everywhere. You can find them. The belt is from uh, Paxson as well. I got this one along with the black one too. And they kind of have like a weaved material and a piece of chain that's weaved in between them too. I think they were about $9.99, $12.99 for two belts. So that's a good price for me. Uh, the watch is from Target, $14.99, and the last thing for this outfit is my little bluebird ring, which I got at PacSun, again, buy one, get one half off. Too. This is the last outfit. Boots are from Payless. They are about five years old. Again, another pair of boots that have been in my closet for years. Uh, they're black suede, wedge heel, fur at the top. These guys were probably about $30, a little bit more expensive than average. Um, jeans are from Target. The vest is from Target 2. I got this in the clearance rack for like $10. Bucks. Um, and the black long sleeve shirt, it's just your basic scoop neck long sleeve. I think I bought a couple of these when I went into Forever 21. I think I got like three of them. I got like a red, a white, and a black, and maybe even a purple one. I can't remember. But they're about like five or six dollars each, so I kind of stocked up on them. Um, for the rest of the outfit, I added my Forever 21 necklace that I picked up here recently. It's kind of like gold. I kind of wanted to warm this outfit up a little bit. It's like a gold tassel necklace and it has a big old pink stone on there and then the last thing for this outfit i just added another one of my other vintage watches for my grandmother so this is going to be the last outfit for this video i'm running out of light it's actually getting really cloudy and gloomy out there so and it looks like it might actually sprinkle so fingers crossed Please take the time to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much. That lets us know, that lets us YouTubers know that you like what we're doing and you're supporting it. So thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys later.